Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Unbreakable Ties. Last episode was absolutely insane. So technically we beat the royal family, but it doesn't really feel like it. So Edward sacrificed himself to protect Derek. He died in Derek's arms. Then Derek got the strength to beat Henry and now Henry has been arrested along with Aldridge, which is oh, fantastic because Aldridge is such a snake. Our character, we lost to Estella and then the champion came, got a bit more strength, battled Estella and the champion together. Obviously there was no way we were going to win that. Estella then used the Intra Ball, uh, a new ball that basically controls a Pokemon completely. Um, went to go catch Latios. Lucario jumped in the way, so we've lost Lucario. It's not going to remember who we are. Just, oh, it was so awful. Uh, the Queen had like her hands chopped off and then killed by one of the butlers. Um, and now we have to head to the Execution Zone, uh, which I guess is probably going to be renamed now. Because Liberty has a message for everyone, which I assume is going to be like, you know, oh, we uh, now won. Lugano is free. Also, we're playing as Luvia. Uh, what's that team, by the way? Oh. Very Hoenn themed team. <laughs> got room for one more. That last Pokemon's got to be a Hoenn Pokemon, surely. And let's go to the execution zone and see what's going to happen. The last episode was absolutely insane. This game is just incredible. What's this commotion? What happened last night? Doesn't that guy up there look like Liberty? But. Wasn't that guy captured years ago by the royal family? It's 12 o'clock. Sharp, Mr. Liberty. I'm more surprised Liberty's wearing a suit. <laughs> so it's being broadcast all over Akabia, sir. Please pay attention. Dear citizens, it seems that the wind of freedom has started to blow again. <laughs> I am Liberty, your former president of Akabia. Is he the same as 15 years ago? Where have you been, Liberty? We missed you! Silence, please. The royal family managed to capture me, but I escaped. I never decided to strike back in the name of the people. If I couldn't defeat them, the consequences and reprisals would have fallen on you. Then, I decided to build my own town in the sewers of Lugano City, where I've lived for over 15 years. If they didn't let me leave Lugano City, at least I would have the freedom to help and accompany the humble people who had no choice but to live there. All this time living with the street people in the sewers? I can't believe it. We thought you had fled. Now he was too busy playing Genshin Impact, man. <laughs> but how did you come back to the surface, Liberty? Uh, well... Well... I had a compelling reason. Yeah, Sakura. I can't tell the bus here. <laughs> so after hearing investors' words and taking the fear away from the people, I decided to ally with some people who came to find me to overthrow the royal family. Early this morning, a group of young people determined to change the future of Akabia fought tirelessly against the royal family to restore freedom to the region and recover their own friends. And after a hard sacrifice and some considerable losses on our part, finally, the dictatorship of the royal family... It is ended! <laughs> He's just not naked again. What? That's big news! Now I can live off my art without paying a fortune in rent. I can start working 12 hour days to feed my children. Brother, now we can afford one of those cool bikes that go vroom vroom! <laughs> The royal family's outrageous taxes are over. The census executions are over. Now, the region of Akabia is once again free. So I'll be the president of Akabia again. <laughs> now we can walk naked on the streets again. Is it liberty that only you do that? <laughs> well, maybe. Listen carefully. It's not over yet. I must give a message to the world. And that is... There are members of the royal family still hiding somewhere. Does that mean they'll invade Akabia again? Should we fear them then? Don't panic. We don't know what their next move will be, but it can't be good. In the meantime, let's thank the victory of our young heroes. But, where are those heroes they speak of? Oh, Edward and uh, Lilith's grave. But why? Why didn't you tell me earlier, Alama? Why didn't you tell me about mum and dad? I'm sorry for hiding your whole story, Derek. I couldn't just tell you the sad past of our parents. Mum told me to take care of you. I had to abandon you because of the poison amethyst injected me with to keep you from being caught. Luckily, I recovered and met Ladios and Ladias, who took care of me on Southern Island, along with Olivia, who was still a baby. However, I lost my memory and didn't hear anything about you. Through a photo I kept of Mum with you, Edward and Angie, I was able to recover my memory, investigate what happened in that accident, 
and discovered that there was a boy very similar in Sparrowtown. I decided to do everything possible to be close to you again. However, for fear of being recognized or linked, and put us in danger. With Savano's help and his influence in the royal family, I changed my name and posed as an ordinary teacher. So, I could have you close and you wouldn't suffer so much from the lack of a mother love. I just wanted you to grow up in a slightly healthier environment than you had. Forgive me, Derek. Thank you for everything, sister. But Derek, even though our parents aren't here now, you're still by my side. At last, I've broken the chains of uncertainty. <laughs> now, I'm happy to know who I am. Both mum and dad wanted me to become the person who would save Akabia. Now that I know my past, that will be my goal. I'll protect the Ladios sphere and end the existence of the royal family. I'll break the chains that anchor you to a celestial family that does not represent you. Oh, Derek. Oh, Angie's down there as well. And Gallade. Hey, hey, crying so much doesn't exactly run the family. I'm sorry. You too? Will you help me? She knew I was here. Aunt Angie. I guess for you, it's also been tough. Don't worry, little, little Lilith, I'm fine. Now we must make Grandpa's dream come true. Will you help me achieve Edward's goal, Gallade? Then I'll take you with me. By the way, Derek, you should go look for Ada. She disappeared just this morning. That's right. I still have to talk to her about what happened in Cardinal City. Anyway, I think I know where she might be. I'll go find her. But before that, we need to say goodbye properly. Edward. So thank you, Dad. Thank you, Mum. I hope you reunite beyond the skies and enjoy a future you can never have. It's Seda. You know I find her around here. So let's hope I don't mess it up. Hello, Ada. Uh, long time no see. I'm not good at these things. In the end, both Alama and I are safe. I guess you must have heard about everything that happened. They told me you came to save me. I appreciate it. Hey, is everything okay? Oh, I know what's going on. You're still mad about uh, what I said in Cardinal City, right? You're right. I acted like an idiot. Oof. Hey, what's that for? You hurt me, you know? You're an idiot, Derek. Don't you ever think about me? Don't, uh, don't you ever think about me? Uh, what do you mean? Oh, don't ever do it again. Don't disappear from my life like that again. I don't want to be separated from you again. Ada, how could you infiltrate the palace alone? You could have died. I've been so scared, Derek. I spent many nights unable to sleep well thinking about you. For a moment I thought, I would never see you again. I... I can't imagine a future without you. I'm sorry, Ada. I've been irresponsible. I'm sorry for making you worry about me. From now on, whenever we have any problems, we'll solve them together, okay? Okay. You really slapped me hard on the cheek. Sorry, I went overboard. <laughs> uh, do you know the best remedy to cure it? A fight? Now? What are you doing? <laughs> the pain was on the other cheek! <laughs> Idiot. Uh, do you want me to slap the other cheek too? D I didn't say that. <laughs> uh, you sure know how to upset me, Ada. That's my specialty. Really? I've missed you. <laughs> I'm glad to have you close again. Aw. That's sweet, man. But get to us! And so... Ada and Derek reconciled. However, where was Voltsy? That same night. Oh, back in Sparrowtown. Riolu. Riolu. Oh, this is so depressing, man. It's true. He... He's no longer with me. Honey, your father had already made dinner. He made the burgers you love so much. Oh, nice. 
My boy, it's been like this all day. Don't know how to cheer him up anymore. Oh. Now you're Voltsy's friends, right? I'll leave you with him. I trust you know how to cheer him up. We knew you'd come back here, Voltsy. Livia informed us about what happened with Lucario. We're very sorry for what happened. It's partly our fault. If we hadn't involved you in all of this, maybe you wouldn't have lost Lucario. Come on, cheer up, Voltsy. We must keep going. We'll find Lucario. No, it doesn't make sense to go anywhere anymore. Without Lucario by my side, none of this would make sense. Now, he won't even remember me. His memories were erased. I can't stand the idea of reuniting with him and him not remembering me. Voltsy. <laughs> must thank you for saving Ladios. Don't know what would have happened to me without your help. I'd probably be in the same situation as you. You've always helped us with everything. You complete our triangle. Without you, none of this would have been possible. <laughs> Thank you for being our support, Voltsy. <laughs> That's right. Now it's our turn to return the favour. We'll help you get Lucario back. Besides, there's no artificial power capable of breaking the bonds that Lucario and you have. I'm sure you'll find a way for him to recognise you again. Guys. Thanks. I needed that. Yeah, man, we've got unbreakable ties. But what do you think if we have a Pokemon battle to cheer up a bit? <laughs> now that we're together again, it'd be great to see how much we've progressed after so long. <laughs> I like the idea. Besides, we're in the same place where we had our first battle. Although Ladios is still recovering from his injuries. Are you ready for a fight, Ladias? <laughs> so let's go to the arena then. I mean, kind of feels a bit unfair that my ace Pokemon is uh, yeah, no longer with me, but well, it's time to show you how much we've progressed. Go ahead, chick. I'm on fire, on guard. All right, let's go. Definitely an unfair fight. Hopefully it's not too long till we get Lucario back. Then we're gonna go Dingle. Go for a nice Thunderbolt. That's not too bad. I mean, I could probably go Alakazam and just set up a few uh, Calm Minds. So I'm pretty sure I, I swept Ada before with Alakazam, didn't I? <laughs> can do it again! Alright, uh, Haxorus. Um, let's go to Sylveon. Let's Moonblast ya! Moonblast. Oh, that was close. And we got flinched! Ah, oh, dude! Okay, that sucks. That really sucks. Um... What do, what do? We're gonna go ahead with Inferno. Flinched again. Can we just like not get flinched, man? It's <laughs> so annoying. Alright, Alakazam. Psychic, just finish it off. Dude, finish it off. It sucks and a cr critical hit. Dude. This is unfair. <laughs> this is so unfair. Oh, great. Now this is out. Right, what I'll do is I'm going to Max Revive Alakazam. Fine, take a bit of damage. Hopefully outspeed you and then Psychic kill you. Okay, good, good. Just think, if we didn't get flinched all those times, easily, easily win this. Special defense drops in very nice. One more shiny. Ooh, that's a critical hit. What is up with all these like crits and flinches you're getting, Ada? So unfair. Oh no. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go psychic. I don't know if I outspeed you, but I think Thunderbolt should kill you. Should I play it safe? I'll play it safe. I'll play it safe. Just in case I can outsped us. healing. And all you'll do is go for Night Slash, kill the laddie ass, there you go. Man, that fight was annoying. Yeah, even without Lucario, I can still beat you. No way. Even with laddie ass, I'm not able to beat you? Maybe if someone had hugged me a little longer this afternoon, I would have had the strength to win. <laughs> it's my turn, Ada. It's been a long time, right, Voltsy? 
Now that Grovile has been able to seep deep into my heart, our bonds have become much stronger. Go ahead, Sceptile. Show me everything you've learned. Alright, let's go. Star up first. Uh, that's fine, let's go for Moonblast. Alright, I'm gonna go for a light screen. Never mind, I really thought I could get that off. Right, uh, let's go go Dengo. I love Quick Claw, man. Quick Claw comes in clutch. Uh, Magmorta. Mm, I think it's got it's got to be Alakazam. What else can we go into? As much as I want to go for a Calm Mind, I think actually, you know what? I'm gonna go for a Calm Mind now. I shouldn't have got Calm Mind. I thought I'd be fine. And then obviously, not. Alright, Power Gem it. Oh, so weak. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We're just about living in quick floor. Sweet. Okay, we can turn this around. Garchomp. Uh, oh, man. <laughs> can Sylveon, but... Yeah, Skorada can probably get away with this, yeah. Yeah, Scrod is just too good. Such a banging Pokemon. Alright, Sceptile's coming out. Uh, go. Chandelure. Go for Inferno! Alright, Inferno. Come on, one shot it. Nice! Okay, Mimikyu's last one. We can stay in. Shadow Ball. Never mind. I want to just uh, break your. Okay, this is <laughs> All right, I don't think it will one-shot me, so I could. Oh, wait a second, it might play rough. I better play it safe. Mm. Just get Sylvie on. Sword start. Okay, that's scary. Okay, break the disguise. Yeah, there's the play rough. Up the Sylveon. Okay then. I don't know, like one shot me. You did great, Sceptile. That was an amazing battle. Well, that thing is karma. I need to tell you that. I don't want to be a Pokemon Master anymore. But what Explain the whole story to his adoptive father. So Sunday, August 13th at 10 p.m. or 10 a.m. Right. Uh, let's just head on down. Hey, old dad. I know you're strong, Voltsy. I'm sure you'll find Lucario and travel together again. Cheer up. I hope so. I guess our mum's gone to work. So good morning, dear. Your friends left a while ago and didn't want to wake you. They told me they're waiting for you in a hideout in Lugano City, in the meeting room. So I guess you'll leave without even having breakfast. Hope you come to see your father and me from time to time. So be very careful and good luck with the rest of your journey. Maybe everyone is gathered in Lugano City again. Let's go to the hideout. All right, let's go. Right, 
to Lugano. So I wonder if we can, I don't know how big this game is. I think it was like um, six gyms, right? I assume we probably can't go past here. For like, we might end after we get the sixth gym badge, which I assume is going to end up being Liberty, right? And let's go to the casino. All right, casino is this way. I think to the right again, right? Should be used to Lugano City by now, but it's so big. Yeah. All right, to the hideout. Love the music here. Good, all right. Down the lift. Be free. Nope, it's the kitchen. It wasn't P1, was it? No. P2. No, that was P3 again. P2. Yeah, all right, cool. So I know we're all a little sad about Edward's loss. Since he's no longer with us, I'll be the spokesperson. Don't mind if you go naked at a party, I might do the same. <laughs> but couldn't you wear your suit for the, the occasion, Liberty? <laughs> You're so funny sometimes. What a funny joke. <laughs> anyway, even though we've suffered a great loss, the mission went better than expected. <laughs> having recovered Derek, Alama, and having Ladios back with us is a miracle. And not only that, but we've changed the system after more than 15 years. <laughs> we should be proud. Hm, all thanks to me. But, but you didn't do anything. Actually, turn the security cameras off, but where'd you go, butt smell and run? Well, I had to go to the bathroom in the middle of the mission. I let Ditto handle everything. <laughs> first needs come first. I understand you. Putting that aside, um, Henry and Aldrich were taken to prison, Amethyst was found dead in the palace, and the others escaped. Seems they had a conflict among themselves. Hmm. On our part, Sakura and I managed to stop Dynamo and save Kaleo, while Voltsy recovered Meloetta. And now, after this radical change, I can't leave the town hanging. <laughs> I've decided to take responsibility for Akabia. I've returned to the presidency. Still can't believe this naked man is now the representative of Akabia. <laughs> By the way, where are Yang Zhao and Celeste? They are in the hospital. They suffered a terrible encounter with William and both ended up with serious injuries. Doesn't seem like they're able to move again for a while. How horrible. Poor things. It's incredible how much you've done for us. This is, our f this is all our fault. I feel the same. We owe you our lives. Don't worry, we'll do anything for you. Now, there's something we didn't manage to get. They took the Celestial Flute. As expected, it's the most sacred treasure of the royal family. Celestial Flute? Do you mean this toy? Uh, wait, what? Uh, how is that possible? Where'd you get that? Did I went to get it while I went to the bathroom? So when you proposed the goal of stealing the Celestial Flute, I started making a plan. I told you when like Amethyst picked it up and it was like said it was like covered in goop. I thought Rodolfo might have got to it first. I asked Livia if we could go to the gallery and there I got to meet Bianca. I got along well enough with her to tell her my plan and have her lend me the Celestial Flute, flute Replica. Wait, when you wanted to go to the art gallery, what did you get the replica of the Celestial Flute? Hm, absolutely. Oopa. <laughs> Wait kid, does that mean the flute they have in the gallery is, is, is the gallery's replica? You underestimate me, adults. Ditto bought the replica with him during the intrusion into the palace. And when Ditto found the mechanism that turned off all the cameras, pow! Down, <laughs> oh, this is so getting copyrighted, this music. Oh, so the flute is the real one? <laughs> this kid never ceases to amaze me. I don't want to be a party pooper, runt, but you should give it to me. Now, that flute is very dangerous. I don't want to. This toy is mine now. Although maybe I'd sell it and buy a couple of ice creams and infinite peanuts. <laughs> Run, don't bug me. That artifact could put the entire region in danger. I'll stop insisting, Angie. There's no way to convince Rodolfo when he gets something in his head. Fine then, do whatever you feel like. Now the important thing is, what should we do? Uh, even though we have the flute in our hands, Ladios and the region are in great danger. So someone should travel to the Southern Islands to ensure we get the Ladios sword before the royal family. Ada and I will take care of that. We can travel with Ladias and Ladios. We'll be there in an instant. I like the idea. I love tropical islands. Great. We'll let the couple take care of this. By the way, we heard what happened with, Lu with Lucario. We're sorry for your loss, Faulty. Thank you. I'm better. Even so. I'd like to discuss something urgent with all of you. 
So Volti explains everything Estella told them about Arceus, her main goal, and her new military power, the Flawless. Reset the universe? Kill a kid's called Fly Gunless? Now I really don't understand anything. I see. So Estella was the one pulling the strings all of, of all of this time. That's why she tried to go unnoticed. Estella. That's a threat far beyond what we imagined. We must stop this as soon as possible. I'll stay at the palace to look for information on the hideout mentioned by Voltsy. I have some vague memories from when I was little that I'd like to look into. Then I'll stay and watch over Celeste and Yang Zhao health. Uh, that way, I have a llama close. Now that my brother has returned to our tribe, I'll go back to Greenfinch City. Someone has to guard the gym. Also, I feel my strength is no longer comparable to some of yours. I'll continue with the stones business, and I can't leave my fans hanging either. So much time without rocking is making me lose my personality. But as soon as we know where the royal family is, count on my help and that of Raikou. Oh, she got it? Sweet. Uh, great. Looks like each of us has our own goal. What will you do, Voltsy? Hmm. Without knowing where the royal family is, you won't be able to locate your Lucario. Now that you mention it, what can I do until then? You're trying to get the gym badges, right? <laughs> Let's go outside then. I need to tell you something. Well, we're ready. By the way, Voltsy, do you think you could return the sacred water jar to my friend from Bullfinch Jungle? <laughs> the jungle friend? The it's not too far from here, and you can ask for Cheyenne in Bullfinch Village. They know him. <laughs> Only if you have some free time. Okay. Now it's time to go, Voltsy. Thank you very much for everything. So we'll go protect the Latios Orb, and we'll meet again. So from here on, we might enter the final stretch. We'll stay in touch with Alama and the rest, no matter what happens. So we're going to the Southern Island. I understand, so we'll be guarding the sewers. And many have gotten used to the life they had there. But don't worry about them, I'll take responsibility. If you need help with anything, let me know. <laughs> Alright Voltsy, let me tell you. Since the fall of Dynamo, there's not even a gym leader assigned to Lugano City. Although that scoundrel managed to escape, more than 15 years ago, beside the presidency, I also took that role. <laughs> Therefore, I have to be the leader of this city again. Oh, by the way, Voltsy, two things before anything else. The first is that I still hate you to death for trying to attack Sakura, just so you know. <laughs> but you've also been helpful, so I'll reward you with a battle. The second is that I don't like the concept of a Pokemon gym. I like battling outdoors, so I'll be waiting for you at the uh, Floral Peak to challenge me. Only the strongest can reach there, so it's already a challenge in itself. In case you don't know how to get there, I've uh, noted down in that journal you carry. Even so. <laughs> Liberty always wins! Okay then. Uh, are they all gone? Uh, so what are you going to do? Why did you ask me that, Voltsy? Ditto and I plan to head west uh, of the region. Our next destination is a place called Red Wing City. We're still looking for Ditto's home. We've almost seen the entire region. Bye Magikarp! Oh. You can now visit the Bullfinch Jungle and... Tutu Jungle. Okay, sweet. So let's go to Floral Peak. Right, so, uh, can we just like fly? Oh, we can just fly there. Sweet. I say, if we can just fly there, let's do this first. Uh, gotta go find this guy. I don't know where you're gonna be, but someday I'll be in a real ninja and protect my family from the men who attacked us. Well, I don't think they'll be attacking you again, because kind of like good guys now. Right, so where are you? We can go through here now and actually go explore and surf some places because we couldn't surf before. Um, I think the house is over here, right? This one? Yeah. Hello? Who are you? You're not from around here, are you? That's the jar I gave to uh, my master Ada before she left. I see. So you're friends. And she asked you to return it to me? It's hard to believe it's been a week since it happened. This village has gone through many troubles, and since Ada's help, everything has returned to normal. Thank you very much for coming and returning it. Though I don't really know how to thank you. Uh... You mean a Pokemon battle? Not sure if I'm the best for that. Even so, I've been training hard to help my village no matter what. I want to become as strong as my master. So let's go outside. Okay, so I spent a long time afraid of Hakan, but it's not the same- I'm not the same anymore. I'll show that I can protect my village. 
Come on, Voltsy. Show me what you've got. All right. Let's go. All right, so first things first, let's just go Moonblast. Ooh. Uh, I am going to get taken out here. I think, I, I guess I could switch into Chandler. It might be fine. Oh, you went for Spirit Shackle. I'm so dead. Oh, no, I'll speed it. Sweet. Ooh. That was lucky. All right. Uh, Cleavor's Bug Rock, isn't it? Um, I'm just going to stay in before I'm switching. Oh, of course we missed the Inferno. Miss it so much. What to go to? What to go to? Um, go Dingo. Let's try Power Gem. Not bad, not bad. Sweet. Is there any other place I, I should check out now I think about it? Um. I guess I could. Oh, you got Mega Heracross. I guess I could go through the. The jungle, we'll just check there. It's a bit of area around the uh, the peak we can go check out. Also, as Edward, maybe head back to the palace if we can, so, so we can like look around the there and maybe pick up some things. There's a lot of potentially do. Let's go psychic on this. Don't kill me. Oh, just living. It's fine. It's fine. Maybe head to the hospital. See if we can find Sakura. Go visit uh, Celeste and Yang Xiao. Might have lost Mega Lucario, but if we can find a Mega Stone for um, Alakazam, that should be kind of clutch. Also, we should be looking to get an another team member. Incredible! I guess I couldn't expect less from one of Ada's friends. Maybe? Maybe I'm not cut out for this. Savannah should take my place. Uh, Really? Do you mean it? You should have more confidence in yourself. Keep training and you'll be able to protect the village without any problems. You're right, I'll keep improving. Thank you so much, Foxy. By the way, take this. Oh, sweet. So it might be useful to you. It's one of the many treasures Hakan returned to the village. If you want a real challenge, I suggest you go to Tutu Village. Hakan is always willing to fight. You'll probably find him at the summit. Definitely gotta do that. Right, so actually there's also another thing I wanna do. Uh, someone told me the location I missed this um, achievement. I want to go and do that side quest. Uh, it looks like oh yeah. So if we go visit uh, Sakura and Yang Zhao, I'm guessing that'd be two quests there we can do. Uh, anything else? Well, that's going to be annoying to do. Defeat the... Oh, that... I saw the quest for that, but I don't know how to start it, I think, but... I feel like I found five. Unless the, uh, the, the, the link videos don't count. Right. So. Uh, let's... Right, let's... Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to think of everything I need to do. We'll go and take on... Um... Hakan first. Luckily, I have to fight all these people. I'm gonna pop a repel. So, who should the sixth team member be? I'll look in the box when we get a chance. We've got a Master Ball now, so I could potentially just like get anything I really want. Um, but the problem is, I don't know how long we're gonna be without Lucario. Do I not have any repels? If I've gone past it, or I've got no repels. Anyway, it's fine. Just gonna run through. Not too bad. But look at our team. Maybe I can use the uh, the palafin now. Get a water type. Oh, there's lots of potential we can use. All right. I'm trying to remember how to get through this forest as well, because it's obviously been a while. So far, so good. You don't want to fight? Yeah, they'll come for you. Okay. Uh, 
let's keep going this way. I feel like it was... I don't like a little bit we'd go through. Unless I serve across here. Yeah, okay, this is fine, this is fine. This is the way. Alright, so now we're in the village. I forgot as well, I can just use the PC whenever I want. I always forget about that. Oh, it's a shiny Porygon we got before. Could always bring Sarah Ledge back. <laughs> oh, I do want to use a Cinderace. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, I'll put it on the team for a bit. Start getting some. I can use the rare candies actually in the. Um... Oh, I got to interrupt the Vaporeon. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay, this is not the peak. Uh, how do I get to the peak? Ah, this way. Sweet. This is the bit I remember, and I think I have to go this way and then get to the middle bit. That's a dead end. Feels like so long ago I came through here, but... Actually, what part was it? I feel like Lugano City, the arc was so long. That's such a long time in Lugano. Yeah, I think this is the way to go. And we'll beat Hakan and then... Uh, decide what I'll do next. Hey, oh! Now that the royal family has been annihilated, it's time to conquer the whole world. My tribe will conquer Akabi- And who are you? I don't remember seeing you before. It's clear you come from the city by those clothes. Haven't you learned anything? I'm not really involved, but... The people of Bullfinch Village believe you've changed, Hakan. Who do you think you are? I set aside the invasion of Akabia for my brother, and because we had to end the royal family. Now that no one can stop me, it's time to evolve. Akabia will be at my feet. I won't allow it. Oh, Hakan. <laughs> Alright, uh. It's the best thing to do. Probably just go into Shandler. Oh, gosh, I went for a knockoff. Alright, that's. that sucks. That's a really annoying. Ah, oh, I think, uh, let's. Draper is such an annoying Pokemon for us to beat. I'm gonna go for one nasty plot. Okay. Thunderbolt. Not bad damage. Nothing more quick claw sucks. Uh, Torterra. It's fine. Got the floor healing. Do some damage. We've got full restore, so I'm not too worried about the, um, poison. Yeah, that earthquake does nothing! <laughs> nice. Uh, what's the land? Dive? Sure, I need to see how this thing evolves. I was going to just look at the, uh, the menu, which is great in this game. But if we stay in, go for U-turn, that should delete you. Oh, just living. Oh, you got focus that, that's why. I'm actually going to go into Finizen, because I don't want to go into anyone else to like take damage. And then we can go... Uh, back into Florigato. U turn. Annihilate's coming out. Let's go see. Is Annihilate fighting Ghost, or is it just pure Ghost? I feel like there's going to be fighting ghosts. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, fighting ghost. Sweet. Venusaur, Venusaur. Alakazam, go for Psychic. It's going to be Mega Venusaur, isn't it? Ooh. 
Right, last one. Oh, we've got this in the bag, man. We've got this in the bag. Oh, if I just uh, yeah, get the psychic off, you should die. Nice. Good job, team. Ooh. Again, the people of the city that strong? Yeah, man. This is um, this is at my weakest as well about my Lucario. What's with the city people? You're very strong. There's not much, but I have many precious stones. Never returned many of them. It's time to change my way of seeing things. It'll be more than enough for me if no one managed to take away my jungle king throne. Well, Rodolfo has already taken it. <laughs> Alright, so. Uh, let's... I think... Ah, oh, I forget which place it was at. Need to double check. So I'm going to end this part right here. What we'll do next episode is we are going to go... To do that side quest, get the achievement we missed, then I'm going to go back to Lugano City, go to the hospital, see if we can see Sakura, Celeste, and Yang Zhao, see how long that takes, and then after that, go and take on the sixth gym, and then that might be the end. But I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.